In a world searching for gleaming knowledge comes the man, the myth, a legend in his own mind, Critical. Welcome back, guys and gals. Critical here. Today I'm bringing another episode of Subsistence on Season 5. And yes, I am alive. Well, obviously, because I'm talking, but my uh, situation with being sick is I am feeling much better. Only took a week to finally get to the point that I felt like I could actually record and not hack up a lung continuously. No, I don't think it was human malware. That's just barely reached my area of the country. Um, we'll keep you posted. A uh, couple things. I just put down another uh, power storage because I want to make the recurve bow. I need two more weapons parts. I need to make some more metal ingots. But the big thing was the power, 150 power, or excuse me, 1700 power and 150 mass. The mass will come up over the day. I've got the generators on. Speaking of the generators, let's go top that off. Generator. Though a second one would be nice. I need to think about that. Oh, doing sweet. Let's put one. That's good. Don't want to push it. All right, so the sun's just coming up. I should be able to, uh, to go out and get some hunting done. Um, for me, we're actually doing pretty good. I've got some rabbit already cooked, ready to go. Having a fridge is just amazing. So happy I, I made the effort to get that crafted as soon as possible. I, ooh, I scared a rabbit in my house. I didn't think the rabbits could, hmm. Okay, well, you learn something new every day. I think the rabbits could hear you or it could be afraid of you if you're actually in your house, but I guess that doesn't work that way. Um, what do I want? Uh, well, a wolf, obviously, because it's one of the easiest things to take down to get meat and resources. I will take a deer if I can uh, get my hands on one or a moose. Huh. Oh my god, look at the spawn of all. This is an awesome spawn spot. Look at this. I've got plants at the yin yang. Level three wolf. I see a, oh, there's a white wolf over there too. There's two bags. I don't know if I want to mess with both wolves. Oh, I see another bag over there. All right, I guess we're going to start really quick and early today. Come here, buddy. Come here. Sit down. Be quiet. Thank you. Reload before I mess up. Now, people were talking about... Oh, look at that. A double liver wolf. <laughs> nice. People were talking about their controls being reset. This is the first time I've logged into the game in over a week and a half since I got sick. And yeah, all my stuff was reset and I don't know why. So I was in that group. I just never checked to find out if I was. Oh, three lovers out of two wolves. And fell with snow instantly. Now, I know it wasn't an update. I've been uh, paying close attention to uh, what Cold Games is doing or not doing. So, uh, I know it hasn't been an update yet. I think it might have been a Steam thing. But I never downloaded anything. My uh, laptop nor did my uh, desktop actually download anything for subsistence so why they got reset for no reason i can't tell you oh i love this little spawn spot right now this is a good one watch out for hunters but still nice though i do want to kill a couple hunters today i need two more weapons parts maybe i'll get lucky and find one i don't know if they even walk to fishing 
I've had other people on the forums tell me that no, the hunters don't even, they live near a, a pond and in the winter the hunters never come by his place to uh, try to fish. I mean, the only way to find out is to be, you know, go by the lake or go by the pond and see if you see a hunter trying to fish, but... I guess it's a no until we actually see it. I guess that's what we can look at it. Oh, I love this rock. Uh, a couple things. Uh, housekeeping measures. Um, about the forums. There has been some drama, as usual, on the forums. And Yeah, yeah, I know. Drama, drama, drama. But, do me, you guys do me a favor. If somebody seems to be attacking me, okay, if you want to defend me, I, I can't stop you. That's cool. I appreciate it, okay? What I would ask is don't attack people on my behalf. You know, if you want to say, well, that's not true because critical X or critical Y or critical Z, okay, that's fair because you're providing facts or your own personal information to... Uh, to correct a statement that somebody else made. But if you go, you're an, you know, effing this or effing that, and, you know, then, then you're kind of like going off the rails, that's not very helpful. Try not to, try not to be that person. People are going to say what they want to say. Let them say it. I, you know, as long as you're not lying about the game, as long as you're not uh, directly attacking cold games for no reason, I really don't care what people think or say. But if they're attacking cold games unfairly, yeah, I'm gonna come to their defense. Now, why? No, I'm not paid by cold games to be his cheerleader or his protector or anything. But he's the first and only dev that actually took an interest in my channel. And I'd like to consider cold games a friend. This is how I would treat anybody that I consider a friend. You go after one of my friends, I want to kill you. It, it's it's my nature. I am very protective of people that I consider friends. Where's my power? Okay, so the power is doing good and going up. And of course, the mass will come up extremely slowly. Okay, so the rest of the day is... Where's my... Eh, I'm okay for right now. Actually, I should probably grab one of those chickens and, uh, actually, eat a rabbit. Bring a rabbit with me. And let's eat one tomato, just to top off real quick. Okay, so the rest is going to be a resource gathering. So yeah, just don't attack people. If you want to defend, that's fine. Just don't attack people. Somebody made the comment that, you know, I... I have some place where I can go where my lo loyal followers will attack and defend me, you know, like a ravenous army of some sort. Yeah, I don't think that's the way it is, and if it is, don't attack. It's just not worth it. That's all I have. Um, forum information. Cold games. Ooh, cotton seed. <laughs> I got it happy. Um, Cold games dropped some more knowledge about the update. He was responding to somebody who was playing uh, a co-op game that had gotten close to the uh, total build cap that is set in the game. You won't see it unless you're playing multiplayer. I don't think you can get to it in uh, a solo game. But if, it, if you can, everything that you build, everything that we put down, takes up what's considered like a slot. It's a, a build number. And there's a storm coming in. What's the temperature? Negative five. I'm okay for right now. Ooh. But if I want to get a hunter, I need to do so quickly. But everything takes up a build spot. I'm trying to remember off the top of my head. Like a solar panel takes up one. And then like every 20... Uh, like every 20 walls makes up one if I if I remember correctly and I think it's like 800 or 8,000 or something like that uh, was the build cap 
and he was mentioning that those that have built really large and some of the times some of the reasons that i've restarted the game and this is a little this is me trying to protect cold games some i guess some of the reasons i've restarted the game i'll say you know i got bored with that world or i wanted to try something different you know a lot of it in honesty was to the point where that world had got to the point that my build was was large enough that my frame weights would drop when i did when i had water world just above the cave that place i had built that to um, a huge base at one point but anytime that i looked anywhere at my base my frame weights would plummet i mean just horrible Okay, this is editing critical. I noticed at this point that I actually lost a train of thought, meaning this isn't scripted. I was just speaking about, you know, the stuff I wanted to talk about, and I started having a fight with the hunters, and I never came back to it. What I was trying to say was, Cold Games showed us a picture of a world, I guess he was using for testing, and it had what it appeared to be like 30 or, or, or more hunter bases in a tight area and he showed us a before picture and an after picture the before picture had a frame rate of like 7.93 and the after picture after the updates and the improvements he's done to the game to the the rendering system i guess the frame rate was over 70 and not only that the world's color looked better the shadows looked correct like they seemed to be falling correctly and they looked um, almost like deeper and richer. So there's been a dramatic improvement in the overall graphic quality of the game, while at the same time, massively improving the frame rates in the game. That is something that doesn't happen very often. So I'm very excited for that. Now, let's get back to me missing this hunter that was sitting down and not moving. I mean, how the hell do you miss a hunter that is sitting down? Well, basically, I didn't aim correctly, but you get the idea. Oh, how did I miss that? I'm an idiot. I still, I'm gonna get me a hunter. Come on. Go back to where you're at. Make it easy for me. Come on, get out from behind that tree. Get your butt down. Okay, that's just uncanny. I lifted it just enough to make sure that I'd be hitting this. You know, I need to stop aiming for the head. This isn't a good rock to attack from, but it's what I have. Hunter nearby. But he didn't see me yet or didn't know I was here. tree hugging hunter well not hugging I guess because he's chopping the tree but there was a hunter pretty close by I could hear his footfalls his footsteps or it was my it was me I had that little bug where you kind of like walk in place Ah, now I see you. <laughs> oh, come at me in a straight line, buddy. That's right. Oh, he's taking four arrows. Yeah, I definitely want my upgrade. Well, there's one weapon part. Bandage real quick. Okay, is the other guy already dead? Out and about. What's your dealio? Stuck inside? Hello? Yeah, I think he's stuck inside. 
Or... No, I'm pretty sure he's stuck inside. Uh, oh, almost. Yeah, he's inside. Come on, buddy. Come on out. Come on, play. He's not worth it. I'm just going to leave. One, I'm taking cold damage, and I don't want to lose my buff if I can help it. And he's just going to... I mean, he's safe. He might as well stay in there. If he does come out to the second floor, he's just going to... Uh, and I do kill him. I won't be able to get his bag more than likely, so it's not worth the ammo. I mean, that one hunter took four arrows. That's... That sucks. Alright, hold on. Storm coming in. We'll go home. Get some food. Hunker down a little bit. Drop off what we got. Then we'll try to get out and maybe get some wood. Or I can take care of the planters, because I haven't done that today. Full on blizzard. Oh, scrap. I want the scrap, please. Thank you. Oh, there's a potato. Nice. Ah, uh, the bl wonderful blue glow. Hopefully Cold Games doesn't take that one away. I think that one should stay. Just because I like it. Uh, now, I started making uh, cordage. Using up my fiber, and I made a lot of fuel bricks. Well, it was quiet and nothing else to do. I figured I could get a start on that. One more weapon part. Ah, uh, torture. The torture is real. I mean, it could be worse. You know, it could be a lot better, too. Alright, save the potato. Go, um... Let's see. Let's cook a chicken and one steak for now. Probably should hunt a little bit more. Having the refrigerator is definitely making this winter a lot easier. But I definitely should hunt when I can. Right, quickly. Uh, take out a tomato. Put that in. So I'm like, why are you doing that? You just wasted a tomato. Yeah, so I wasted the tomato. I've got a uh, cotton seed I have to plant. Hmm. I, you know, I'm wondering if the snow doesn't provide at least a little bit of water. Because I haven't watered that all day. Oh, yeah, I need to hunt more. This cold is definitely taking a, a bite out of me. My proteins are just plummeting. Let's see if I can get that sweet spot. Come on. There we go. Saves me from going outside. It's a nice little, nice little workaround. Let's go and eat the steak immediately. It might as well. Oh, here's a question. Something I want to see. Okay. I've, I know these things will eventually turn into dirty water. When the sum... When the... Uh, after a long period of time. Uh, like when the... When the temperature changes and becomes summer. What if I put it in a refrigerator? Can I keep... Um, a canteen full of snow in my refrigerator. That'll never... Uh, melt. We're going to find out now. It's the little things I like to test. You know, I wonder this and I wonder that. It means I'm short one canteen, but I guess I'll get over. Man, I used up a lot of ash up there. Oh. Thank you. And drop that right in there. Save the timer on it. Um... Put one 
there. Put one in. Perfect. Where is my... Oh! I've got the power now. I just need the mass and one more weapon part. I'm at 14 weapon parts. Oh, this, the storm seems to be ebbing. Maybe I can go piss off the other hunter camp real quick. Or, you know what? I'm going to run back to the other one that's close to me. And see if the hunter that was stuck inside has come out. I don't mean stuck inside. It's like when you attack, they're like, their AI is like, stay inside. I don't think they, they'll come out. But maybe now that it's been, it's quiet... The other hunter has come out and is not stuck inside the house. If he does come out, I will kill him for his weapon part. Okay. Oh, yeah, I see a hunter. He's just sitting there. Oh, he saw me. <laughs> Proof positive they can see you from a distance. There we go. Run straight at me. Take two hits. That's right. One more hit should do you. Come here. I don't want to bleed this time, but I can help it. There we go. Good hunter, give me a weapons part. Yes! I have all the weapon parts that I need now. Now I just need to get the power and the mass. Ah, oh, I was hoping he'd have food cooking for me. Bad hunter. Anybody else? Uh, I didn't want to piss off two hunter camps if I could help it. This way I've only pissed off one hunter camp but I've got 200 kills and that's pretty good just want to check the general area over here the sun is starting to yeah it's right there it's getting close I don't want to get too far away from my base it's negative 2c but once the uh, the sun starts going down oof, cold will set in very quickly and I want to be careful about that. Let's check the lake real quick. Oh, rogue camp. Rogue hunters with three rogue hunters. Ooh. Well, I don't mind if I... Well, I might mind. Let's see. I can get up on that rock, but I don't know if I can get up on that rock with... The wolf right here. Ah ha ha! Alright, so the one that's sitting down... I don't think has a helmet, so... Oh, just laid his butt down. I had to aim a little bit lower to actually hit him in the head. I missed that shot. I just a shot that I make. Come on, step back out. Whoa! That arrow went right past my head. I was moving forward into it almost. Okay, so the guy that's left has a helmet and fully armored. Oh, and he made me bleed already. I hate when they make me bleed. Uh, especially when I don't have any more bandages, that's not good. And unfortunately, a first aid kit won't protect me from bleed, so it's kind of like I need to run home quickly or get lucky and get a bandage. Okay, no, not what I'm looking for. No. But I will take my arrow back, thank you. Eventually, I'll stop bleeding, but hopefully... It'll be... Ah, I wish I could break apart the one of the splints that I have. Oh. 
I was hoping to get with the uh, with that lock crate I saw over there. I was hoping to get a uh, lock pick from one of the rogue hunters. Because you can get lock picks; they're extremely rare. I've I've got one when I was off camera, but not. I haven't got one since I've been on camera yet. So now there's still a wolf over here, and I'm definitely weak. But I don't want to use the first aid kit if I don't need to. And I'd already said I needed to hunt some more, so. Come here, buddy. You're gonna be breakfast, lunch, or dinner. You pick a pick. Ooh, thank you, two steaks. And I don't have a canteen of fresh water. You can't use snow to clean your hands either. And I'm trying right now, it doesn't work. Okay, so I let myself get uh, a bleed status with no bandage, like an idiot. And then I went hunting with no way to clean my hands. I'm, I'm doing pretty good today, I have to admit, you know? If there could be a, a dumb mistake, I probably made it. Ooh, another wolf on the way home. Let's skirt that one. Just because I want to get back and get my hands washed. Now, granted, you have... That's like 10 or 15 minutes. Something like that. Until you actually get sick. So, I should have more than enough time to get home. But when I was playing around with... The uh, canteen, let's put it in the, refri uh, the freezer. I should have made sure I had a canteen to uh, drink and or wash my hands at least with me. Want to test things cool, but you still need to play the game. All right, good, 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 good. I like the plants look kind of cool with that blue light coming from under uh, underneath. All right. Wash my hands with extremely hot water. Give me something to drink. Uh, might as well just go ahead and cook these right away. It doesn't hurt to uh, do that anymore because I have a refrigerator to hold it. And I got a lot of good resources. It, that was a decent run. I didn't think I would walk uh, run into a road camp. Hey. Every little bit will do ya. Three more, I'm up to 18 years. And yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna blow up one base. Um, I don't know which base it will be. Probably the one, the first or the second one, one of the, the smaller bases. Based on what you get when you blow up bases, including the, uh, the fortress, I don't think it's worth it to blow up a fortress. Because they take so long to build up, I, I don't. I really just don't think it's worth it. Um, good tonic. I didn't have. I'm gonna save the blueberries for right now. There we go. And then, come on, come on, come on. Let me get my little spot. It's like, literally, it's one. There we go. That one tiny little spot that I can actually uh, do that at. Eat one, put one in here, and eat a tomato. Okay, that was a pretty good day of, uh, of gathering. I need to make... Three, four, and five. Make five bandages, so I finally have. Some. Man, I cannot believe I went out hunting with only one bandage on me. And there's still time in this day. This is this day has just been going. Ooh, hello. Oh, I don't mind if I do. Step out and find a deer just sitting there waiting for me more antlers. Ability to get some more glue, some more cloth. Uh, a little bit of fat and a liver. Okay. 
I would have liked a little bit more fat out of that. That deer, but I'll deal. Let's go ahead. Wash my hands before I forget about it. Oh, this pick is about to break. So I need to make another pick soon. Reload. Oh, I'm not standing on snow. There we go. Ah, pretty sunset and subsistence. Oh. Fiber and an ammo box. Oh, double ammo bag. I do not mind if I do. Level one white wolf. Okay, should be far enough away. I should be able to get this fiber without seeing you off. Oh, more fiber. Rabbit. Oh, and even more fiber. Nice. Anybody who says they can't find fiber, you're not looking for it. Or you're missing it. You're not seeing it. That's what it is. Just like me and blueberries. For, uh, and once the new blueberries were introduced into the game, I had a hard time actually finding blueberries. They were there. I was running past them and around them all the time. I just hadn't trained my eye to see them. Now, once I trained my eye, especially in the winter, oh, nice. Double bandage. Could have used you earlier. All right, not bad. All right, guys and gals, I'm going to go ahead and call this episode here. It's definitely been a good one. We've got a lot of resources. And, ooh, right where I need to be. Let's go ahead and... Did that do it? No, it's 62. Foot half, foot half, 47, one, and one. All right, so that gave me the mass. Oh, I still need ingots. Okay, I need to make the ingots. Uh, do I have what I need? No, I don't. Okay. Hopefully by the morning. Now, let me see. Five. No, I'll, yep. Up, I do have the copper I need. So I just need the iron fragments. I have to go top off the uh, generator real quick. I think it turned off. Yes, it did. It ran out of... Oh, it didn't run out of power. It just filled up perfectly as whole games intended it and keep my power going all right guys and gals yep i'm gonna go ahead and call it here we're really close to making that recurve bow hopefully that'll be next episode i've been critical this has been subsistence on season five hope you guys have enjoyed this content if you have drop a like consider subscribing and i'll catch you guys in the next one take it easy bye